In a world where there is just so much content, now is the time where you need to make sure your content stands out from the rest. To help you do this, there is, of course, Popcorn Theme for WordPress, specifically designed for content marketeers, niche website owners, and affiliate marketers to showcase and portray their content in the best possible way. If you're not familiar with Popcorn Theme, it's a WordPress theme. It's designed by myself, Phil, and Carl. We're all affiliate marketeers and niche website owners, so we know exactly what we need from a WordPress theme in order to put together some fantastic niche websites. Well, in this video, I wanna share with you how you can use Popcorn Theme to make your content pop. And I also wanna share with you the latest release because just the other day, Popcorn Theme version 2.2 dropped. How exciting. In fact, just today, take a look at this. I have been working on one of my new projects, which is snackeagle.com, which is basically the rebrand of Best Corn Popper a popcorn website. And as you can see in front of you right now, the before and after effect of popcorn theme on some existing content. Version 2.2 comes with a whole load of new uh, bug fixes and features. You can find them all in the change log, which I will link to in the description of this video. But anyway, let me just show you that bit of content that I edited today. It's uh, this one right here. It is the Small Popcorn Machines Buyer's Guide. Very exciting, I know. So basically what I've been doing, and I recommend that you do the same thing, is I've been going through all of my old content. I mean, this was originally published in August 2021. Basically going through it, just checking it, checking the products are still available, checking they're still relevant, and just trying to improve the content in any way that I possibly can. One easy way to improve content is to add some extra formatting. So yeah, I've been going through this content and I've been implementing some of the new features that Popcorn Theme now has. And also some of the existing features that were already there that made Popcorn Theme great in the first place. But anyway, let me scroll down. Let me show you this bit of content. So uh, we've obviously got the affiliate disclaimer, which is just part of the template and you can edit it as you like, change the color, change the text. But then we've got this fantastic product box. Now, Popcorn Theme comes with a number of different ways of showcasing products whether they be from Amazon or, or wherever. And um, you can see them on the screen now, uh, some of the variations that are available. I've chosen this one because uh, there was one thing that I learned at Affiliate Gathering, and that is people just don't have the time. They haven't got any time. They want the information as quickly as possible. So I'm just going straight in at the top of this article and saying, you want a good small popcorn machine? This one, just buy this one. Don't even worry about reading the rest of the article, just buy this one. And of course, I've added two uh, button links. Uh, the Amazon is an affiliate link, the eBay one isn't because I haven't got rounds of registering for eBay's affiliate program. But I do know that Google favors multiple merchants uh, within a product post. Google's not too keen if you're just gonna you know, use Amazon links all over it. You'd much rather have a bit, of a bit of a mixture in there. So that's why they're there. Anyway, I digress, let's scroll down. Here we have a notification box. Now with Popcorn version 2.2, there's a whole load of new notification boxes. Look, take a look at these, coming in all different flavors. So you can make elements of your content, those really important paragraphs, stand out and catch people's eyes. Next, we have the AAWP table. Now, AAWP works fantastically with Popcorn theme. And if you're not familiar with AAWP, it's a plugin that enables you to use the Amazon API to pull down product information and portray it in a nice way like this. However, I've got some fantastic news. And that news is that in an upcoming version of Popcorn Theme, we are gonna have some tables just like this that don't rely on the Amazon API. You can put them together using the Amazon Site Stripe. So that's something to look forward to. And of course, if you buy Popcorn Theme today uh, or anytime, <laughs> you will be uh, able to get updates as and when they are released. Let's scroll down. So this uh, is another product box which I've been using. And um, yeah, it's a way of just showing off products and it's got a lovely pros and cons section. Uh, and then I've got another one here, which is bright yellow to make it stand out because this is the editor's choice. This is the product that I want them to, to buy because it's the best one. Then we've got some more product boxes. Okay. Next up, now this I'm really excited about. Look at these bullet points. We've got bullet points with adjustable um, 
graphics for the bullets. So here we've got some popcorn, um, but let me just show you how you set these up. You can see in the panel on the right that, yeah, we've got a whole load of different icons that you can choose. And we're gonna have some more coming in upcoming releases and some more customization options. So you can change the colors and you can really, you know, just go to town on your bullet points because at the end of the day, we all love bullet points because it's the best way of getting information across in a really clear, precise and coherent way. Okay, let's scroll down a bit further. We've got the FAQ. Now I'm using Rank Math SEO uh, FAQ. Easy for me to say. Rank Math FAQ SEO thing, just to add some schema here. And it, of course, works perfectly with Popcorn theme. And there, right at the bottom, we've got a uh, final words box, which it was in Popcorn theme before, but it's got a few more options now. And then we've got the author box, which I've edited to make it look really sophisticated. So that's a quick overview of what's new in Popcorn Thing. Let me just switch back to that, that's better. And well, if you're interested, which hopefully you are, I've got a little coupon just for you, just for this video. I'm gonna put it um, yeah, down there on the screen. You'll also find it in the description. Head over to popcorntheme.com, use that coupon, you'll get a, a tasty discount off the theme. And as I said, once you're in, you're in and you'll be eligible for updates as and when they're released. Now I should say that there is talk amongst myself, Phil and Carl, that we want to change the pricing on Popcorn Theme. We feel that we're giving it away for, well, far too cheaply, if I'm honest. So we are gonna be adjusting the pricing really soon. So if you wanna get it at this fantastic price of $99, plus the special discount coupon below, then yeah, you need to do it pretty pronto. If you've got any questions or anything, then leave me a comment below and I will do my best to answer them and uh, get back to you as quickly as I possibly can. If you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Click that like button and well, yeah, good luck with your sights. I'll see you later.